Hi everybody! Today I'm going to show you how to install ACR presets for both Mac and PC. Now while I'll be working off of a Mac, I'll direct those of you who are on a PC about any differences that you might encounter from that of a Mac user. Now this is a very simple process, but many people are intimidated by it because they aren't necessarily familiar with different folders and programs on their computer, but we're going to remedy all of that for you right now. The first step is to download your purchase. Now it's important to remember when you download your file where your file is downloading to. Now by default, most Mac and PC users will find all of your downloads in your downloads folder. In this case, I've saved my download to my desktop. I just find that that is more convenient for me because I'm usually going to download something that I'm going to use right away. And so it's nice just to have it appear on my desktop and I can just drag it into a program. The preset collection will download as a zip file, which simply means that the files are compressed. To unzip the download, locate the zipped file and double click. The unzipped file will appear next to the zip file. Next, open your finder window. For PC users, you'll open your Windows Explorer. Now there's an extra step here for Mac users, so PC users can disregard this particular step. For Mac users, you'll need to locate your library folder. Your library folder may be invisible to you by default. Now there are a couple of ways that you can find the folder, but the simplest way is to go up to your Go tab on your menu bar, scroll down until you see Computer, and click. From here you want to select Mac Hard Drive, then Users, then select your user profile, and then select Library. From here, in the Library folder, the Mac user will click Application Support. PC users will find a very similar folder in your Explorer window called Application Data. If you don't see your Application Data folder, that's okay. Simply search Application Data in your search bar and then double click to open. From here, the process is identical for both Mac and PC users. So scroll down until you find the following sequence of folders. Application Support or Application Data, Adobe, Camera Raw, and Settings. Now it's in the Settings folder that you'll copy or move your downloaded purchase. Now this is simple but important, so definitely pay attention to this. Don't copy or move the folder itself into the Settings folder because Photoshop won't be able to recognize that folder as a whole. Instead, you need to open the folder and place the actual individual XMP files into your settings folder. So locate your unzipped download and select all the XMP files in that folder. Now you can either copy them and paste them into your settings folder, or you can simply just drag and drop the files. Now go ahead and open an image in Photoshop. If the image does not open in Camera Raw automatically, go up to your Filter tab in the Photoshop Navigation panel and scroll down to Camera Raw Filter. Once the image is opened in Camera Raw, you'll find an icon to the right that looks like an Adjustments panel. Click the icon and you'll find all your Lux ACR presets listed in the window below. Now I would like to emphasize really quick that whenever you download your purchase, it's always a good idea to save a copy of your presets or actions to Dropbox or Google Drive or somewhere in the cloud so it's not only saved to your hard drive. And with that, we're all set. I hope you found this video helpful. Now go enjoy your new ACR presets. Bye now.